see USC with two losses at that point. Is that sort of surprising to you? Um, I don't really have pay attention to the season too much. You know, they, uh, you know, we're all, we're all busy with our own thing over here, and uh, you know, I mean, I'm I'm kind of surprised, but uh, I don't know. I think I see like some teams kind of struggle with adversity, and, and uh, you know, I mean, it's stuff, it's something that they need to work on. You know, when, when uh, things are going their way, they, really, they respond well, they're really well. You know? Do you guys? Is there a sense that they might play with more desperation in a way because they're coming off a loss to Arizona like that? Um, I mean, when you've lost a game, do you feel more motivated that next game? Well, I, I can't. <laughs> I also can't. I mean, I, when the high school I went to Hamilton High School in uh, Arizona, and, and I never lost a game there, and uh, and I haven't lost a game since that since playing here. So I'm not really sure how it feels. Uh, but you know, I mean, I, I think we're just gonna get everybody's best, regardless. You know, what I mean, uh, people are people are out to get us, and uh, you know, we have a US, there's a USC Oregon rivalry. And, and, uh, and you know they're they're really gonna they're gonna give us our best regardless you know whether they lost or, or came off a win or undefeated or um, they haven't won a game yet you know they they're gonna give us their best shot. So what have you seen from their defense on film so far? Uh, athletes, you know I mean they're they're super talented um, and, and aggressive. You know I mean the, the only what we got to do on offense you know, we, we really got to be playing to the whistle with these guys because I mean they're just so athletic and uh, and so talented. You know they. Uh, I think they'll probably be one of the best defensive guys so far. Do they blitz more or less than some of the other teams you guys have played so um, far? I would say average. You know, I mean, ASU blitzed almost every play, it felt like, and then there's other guys in Colorado that only blitzed about 20% of the time. Um, and, you know, these guys, they're kind of they're around the middle of that. And, uh, you know, but when they do blitz, they're, they're pretty effective. You know, they're really tricky, and, uh, you know, we're just going to have to keep our eyes up for them. Are there any key players that you guys have, that you've noticed on the defensive side that um, stuck out? I wouldn't. I wouldn't say so. You know, I mean, I mean, not not saying like there. There's not one guy that's just so talented, it's ridiculous. I'm just saying like they're they're all really good. You know, they they uh, they work as a unit. You know, they, they really come together and uh, you know they make things they make things difficult on the O line, the entire offense as a whole. So I mean, we're really we're just gonna go out there and uh, play our best against each individual player. You guys able to use film from last year's game against USC here to kind of game plan? Uh, we haven't really got that far into it yet. You know. Um, we watched a little bit of uh, personnel film today and uh, a little bit of film from last week's game, you know, uh, correct my mistakes from the Colorado game. And uh, and we'll, we'll definitely be looking, I'm, I'm sure we'll have some clips from last year, you know, just, there's there's a lot of mistakes we made in that game, so uh, we want to correct those. You can hear the fight song playing pretty much nonstop. Oh, um, it's day one and I'm so tired of it already, it's insane. Uh, you know, it's going to give us fire down there, we're, n we're never going to want to hear that song down there, so no first downs, no touchdowns, we don't want any of that. Uh, because, God, that is, it is the most annoying thing. We literally played it probably, we only played two other songs in there, so that's a total of six minutes that the fight song wasn't playing in uh, practice today. So we were all, oh, we were losing our minds. It was, most, it was the worst thing ever. <laughs> Expecting it for the rest of the week. Guys. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're fully prepared. Like, I'm, that's the thing I'm definitely looking forward to the least this week is just coming at 6.30 in the morning and listening to the fight song all day. <laughs> Miserable. Thanks, Tyler. Yeah, exactly. as, as a kid growing up in Arizona, what were your feelings about USC? Uh, you know, I mean, they're, always, you know, they're always one of the elite. You know, they, uh, you know, they're always talented. And Heisman, Heisman Trophy winners, national champions. Uh, you know, just all the time. They're always, they're always dominant. You know, they uh, until recently, you know, they, they uh, before the sanctions, you know, they, they were like they ran the like had the dynasty of the Pac-10. You know, and. Uh, and, and they have they have a lot of tradition there, tradition of excellence, tradition of success, and, and that's one thing. Growing up, like as a kid, um, you really saw it because it really was the USC era when I was in, uh, you know, middle school and high school, and, and uh, you know, I mean, I, I came here because I thought that was uh, going to change a little bit. So, do you think it is changing? Uh, I mean, not the fact that they're not a good team anymore. You know, I just think uh, they're. Ju I think they're just as good as always. Just uh, you know, we're picking it up a little bit. And, and you know we're really having some success here, so I'm, I'm glad to see where we're going. But we'll, I mean, you can't say anything before again, you know. So, it's, so we'll we'll see what happens this Saturday. But so that way, I mean, you kind of briefly said, but that was part of your reasoning for coming here was to help Oregon get to that level. Yeah, yeah I, I thought they were, I thought they were moving in good places, and, uh, and I, I think I was I think I was correct in that statement. You know, they're, they're you know we're doing really well this season so far. But I mean, like I say, we still uh, four or five or four games left in regular season, and then we got the Pac-12 championship and whatever bowl there is. But you know, it's that's the goal is to win Maddie and we just got to let the cards fall in place there. But uh, yeah, I feel like we're moving in that direction and uh, things are going well right now.